fastest growing segment right now in solar installations in Illinois is hog farms, chicken farms, grain elevators. In rural Illinois and rural America, it isn't that this is a bipartisan issue. For them, it's a completely nonpartisan issue. It just makes sense. Everyone on our team has some background in community organizing, in political work, because this is an absolutely crucial part of, of scaling up renewable energy. And what we often do is hold a town hall prior to the official hearing so that people get a chance to look at pictures of what a solar project in their community might look like, hear from us about the details. And quite often, the, the people who will be living right next to these projects show up and, and ask questions. I'll never forget one particular town hall where a woman said, well, would any of you want one of these projects in their backyard? And a, a gentleman um, who was probably in his mid-60s spoke up. He worked at the coal plant in Pekin, Illinois, and his job was the disposal, the shoveling of the coal ash from that coal-fired power plant. And he said, ma'am, I would put all the solar in the world in my backyard so my kids don't have to have a job shoveling coal ash like I do. We celebrate what coal built for us, what the power it brought in the 30s and 40s and 50s meant to these communities, but people recognize that uh, its time has come and gone and are embracing renewable energy. It is actually cheaper to sign a power purchase agreement for a new solar project than to keep your coal plant running. A rural electric cooperative that covers uh, far southern Illinois is closing down one of their coal plants and they just put out an RFP uh, to purchase solar power. I truly believe Illinois has the opportunity to be the Saudi Arabia of renewables. We're in the center of the country. We're in the center of large infrastructure, uh, large grids that go all the way to New York City, go all the way down to New Orleans, go all the way up into Canada. We've got the land, we've got the wind, we've got the sun. Uh, that can really be our future.